Dear students, how are you? We are discussing about voice change and today we want to see how we can change the voice change of interrogative sentence. Okay, it is not difficult to change the voice of interrogative sentence. If you know the rules of voice change, you can easily do this work. Uh, if you want to change the uh, voice of an interactive sentence, you have to follow the several steps. Uh, you can follow the four steps of changing sentence, uh, changing voice. At first, uh, if we want to change the um, voice of interactive sentence, uh, we have to change the interactive sentence into assertive uh, according to the rules of assertive sentence. And then we have to change the sentence into passive according to the rules of passive voice. Um, we all know the rules of changing passive voice and according to that rule we have to change the sentence into passive then um, we have to follow this step put the auxiliary verb at the beginning of the sentence uh, you know that at the time of voice change we use auxiliary verb and um, in third step we have to put the auxiliary verb at the beginning of the sentence if there are two parts of auxiliary verb, put only the first part at the beginning. You will notice that there will be two parts of auxiliary verb and if there are two parts of auxiliary verb, we will put only the first part of auxiliary verb at the beginning. Um, these are the rules or steps of changing interrogative sentence. Um, into passive. Um, now go to the example. Active. Does he play football? It is an integrative sentence. And what is the tense? Okay, it is present indefinite tense. And what will be the assertive sentence? Assertive will be he plays football. And now we will change it into passive and passive will be football is played by him in this sentence uh, there is an auxiliary verb and it is is and we will put this is at the beginning of the sentence then the passive will be is football played by him note of interrogation in this way you can change active into passive and you will notice that in this sentence there is only one part of auxiliary verb if we find we get two parts of auxiliary verb then what can we do okay see this example active is he playing football it is an interactive sentence and the tense is present continuous and at first you have to change this sentence into assertive and assertive will be he is playing football and passive will be football is being played by him in this sentence there are two parts of the verb and is being so, we have to use the first part of auxiliary verb at the beginning of the sentence. So, passive will be, is football being played by him? Is football being played by him? A note of interrogation. So, in this way, we can change the voice of interview sentence we can 
Now we can go to another example of changing the voice into a sentence. Suppose the example is active. They Sorry, this is not in the sentence. In the will be have the done the work. It's an interview sentence, and at first we have to change this sentence into assertive. Um, assertive will be. Passive. passive will be the work has been done by them. Now we will notice that there are two parts of the verb and we will use only the first part at the beginning. Of the sentence, then passive will be passive has the work been done by them. So the passive will be has the work been done by them. In this way, we can easily change the voice of interrogative sentence. Thank you.